Welcome everybody. Today we're here at my home base in the Virgin Islands, which is Trellis Bay in the British Virgin Islands on Tortola. And it's also right next to the airport, which is where my new shipment of Mariner 2 splash drones just arrived today. Something we've all been waiting for, including myself, for a long time. We've been waiting for these since, well, since they were conceived the end of last year. But uh, finally they are in production and I've just had the first shipment arrive and we're going to open one of the boxes today and have a look inside and show you what comes in the package. This is one of the pro version kits, so this is one that's fully set up for FPV flight with all accessories everything included in the box. So I've already cracked the box, we'll have a look here pull out the case and see what we got. All right, and as you can see, they've redone the case. It's all done in splash drone graphics and everything now. So let's have a look. Flip it open, and there we go. Well, we've got the new LiPo charger. That's gonna be nice. I don't know if some of you remember the problems we used to have with the other LiPo charger, but it was a great charger, but very complex for programming. And nothing I got more calls for than just to how to set up the battery charger to get the LiPos recharged. This one's completely plug and play, but we're gonna do that in a separate video and show you exactly how it works later. So moving clockwise through the package, we'll start up front here. And this bag here, we've got our quick release bracket. So this is if you want to drop something, they've got life preserver, everything like that now that you can actually use and drop it from the drone. If you want to take it out as a life-saving device, you can fly the drone right out over the water and immediately drop a self-inflating life jacket to somebody in distress in the water. So that's included with the Pro package. And you can see the wiring's already been configured. They've got the waterproof plug already hooked up, ready to screw into the bottom of the splash drone. And up here, this is the new mounting bracket to mount the LCD screen to the transmitter. So we'll have another video to explain how to build that and assemble, put everything together as well. Over here we've got the power cord. This is the power cord for the LiPo charger. Underneath that we've got our accessory bag for the LCD screen. So this has your antennas for the LCD screen receivers. It's got a video accessory cable and also a charge cable for the LCD battery. Okay, so that's all there. Here we've got extra battery. Now the Pro package only comes with one battery, but I always order mine with spares anyway, so I ordered an extra battery that's included in the package. And you can see they've also upgraded the LiPos in the Pro package to the 4500 4S batteries. Back here we've also got the new propellers. So it comes stock with one set of carbon fiber blades, self-tightening. You can see they've got the self-tightening hubs on them, so no more wrench required to assemble the blades, which is nice. Now you can unpack and pack it quickly for transporting back and forth to the field in the case and not have to worry about unbolting the props every time. And next over here, we have the new Swell Pro controller for the Mariner 2 Splash Drone. And you see it's all outfitted with all the new graphics, titled everything as well. Full feature, this one's gonna have full telemetry, two-way communications back and forth with the Splash Drone, so when it's in the air, you'll be able to tell exactly where it is, what its position is, speed, altitude, everything you need to know, all right on the display right there. And right underneath the transmitter, you see they've got a new cutout in the box for the LCD screen, and they've got a new LCD screen as well, still with the diversity dual tuner, two antenna hookups on top. This one has the sunscreen built into it, so just flip that open, and the other sides flip open automatically as well. Because both the LCD screen and the video transmitter are custom programmable, you can select any of 32 different channels and lock them both in so they stay set where you want them and never change. And we'll break out the Splash Drone itself and have a look. And as you can see, it's got all the new graphics, Swell Pro and Splash Drone graphics, new upgraded 650kV motors, and all the electronics, everything inside is completely redone. So let's open that up and have a look. And inside, you see we've got one of the new Splash Drone 4500 milliamp batteries. Everything inside is all now proprietary Splash Drone by Swell Pro. You got the GPS compass puck right there, the flight controller down underneath, and the radio receiver right beside. And next to that, the red one, you'll see the MI600, which is the 32 channel programmable video transmitter. That's installed inside now, instead of on the bottom where it used to be. So it is no longer susceptible to water damage if you have a forced landing in water. And you'll also notice one nice thing that's been installed here as well is They've eliminated completely the need for the 3S battery on the bottom of the drone. 
So what they've done is installed a voltage regulator to the main motherboard and that voltage regulator is installed right here and you can see 12 volt out and that now replaces the need for the 3S battery on the bottom and this well, this is split so that it will power your video transmitter inside and also has a secondary pigtail to power the gimbal on the bottom. And right here you see this is the new hookup for the wiring. So this is a waterproof connector, has a silicone seal around it, completely sealed all the way around and passes through and this is the wiring connector that will allow you to hook up the quick release mechanism or your gimbal and both of them are designed to fit through this fitting right here. Underneath we've got our landing gear, so that's stored in a different part of the box now. But still got the carbon fiber landing gear with nice finished ends on it now. So that's all included and stored in the bottom of the box. Got your directions for the diversity tuner and the receiver. And your included parts guide. Now the actual operations manual aren't included in the box, but they're available online. So you can go to our website and find them at ambientreallife.com and they'll be in the store section around the splash drone section. And you can also find them on our Facebook page if you visit there. Just go to facebook.com slash groups slash splash drone. And you'll find that link in our text description in the video description here as well. And in this pocket right here, we've got what everybody's been waiting for, including myself, for a long time. And that is the waterproof gimbal. You'll see it's finally been complete. It's in production now. It's all one piece, comes put together with the FPV wire already installed on a GoPro case. So your GoPro is gonna be waterproof now. No worries about water damage or losing the GoPro if you have a failure or forced landing over water. So all the wiring is gonna pass through the bottom of the splash drone. The control box is gonna be inside the splash drone as well. Everything plugs in internally. And this is where it'll connect to your receiver for the roll control and everything and your power harness that hooks up right there. So that we're gonna have a lot of fun with, I'm sure. So we'll be doing some testing on that soon, which you'll all get to see. So be sure and keep an eye out. If you're not subscribed to the channel already, then subscribe and that way you'll get notifications when we put out new videos. But I'll be putting out new videos in the next little while, each step of the process and assembling the unit, putting everything together, how each component works, how to coordinate, calibrate everything, get the gimbal set up and working, and doing our first flight, getting you off the ground. Yes, Lucky. <laughs> Hello. So anyway, like I said, keep an eye out and there's more videos to come. So I hope you enjoyed and I uh, hope you all having a good day and we'll talk to you real soon. Take care for now.